Hi. So today we will learn multiplication of fractions. So in this particular video, we are going to learn multiplication of a fraction by a whole number. So let's first revise the concepts of multiplication in whole numbers. What is multiplication? Multiplication is multiple addition. Isn't it? Yes. Suppose if we talk about 2 multiplied by 3, this actually means 2 times 3, which is 3 has to be added to itself 2 times. So if we add 3 2 times, we will get 6. And if we read table of 2 3 times, 2 3s are 6. Then also we get 6. And what do you mean by 3 multiplied by 4? This is called 3 times 4. That means 4 has to be added to itself 3 times. Right? And this will give you 4 plus 4, 8, plus 4, 12. And 3 4s are 12. Right? So, actually while doing multiplication, you read out the tables. But the actual meaning of multiplication is multiple time addition. Multiple time addition of one particular number. So, this was just the revision of multiplication when both the numbers are whole numbers. Now we will apply the same fundamentals, the same concepts in fractions also. Right? So let's see how we do it. So now suppose you have a fraction which is 2 by 3 and you have to multiply it by 4. What is 2 by 3? If we want to represent this 2 by 3 in drawing, here I have taken a circle. Then I divide this circle in three equal parts like this, right? And 2 by 3 means we have to take two parts out of these three parts. So this is, this was first part and this is the second part, right? Yes. And this is called 2 by 3. So this is the pictorial representation of 2 by 3. Now what we have to do? We have to multiply this 2 by 3 by 4. That means we have to add this 2 by 3 4 times. Isn't it? Yes. So I am going to make 4 2 by 3's like this. So now we have 4 2 by 3's. Isn't it? I have replicated the same picture 4 times. This means this multiplication. Multiply 2 by 3 by 4. So this was 1 2 by 3. And now I have replicated this 2 by 3 4 times. Why only 4 times? Because we were supposed to multiply this fraction by 4. Right? And now if I count the shaded portion which are over here, how many shaded portions do we have? So here we have 1, this is 2, this is 3, this is 4, this is 5, this is 6, 7, and 8 portions. We have 8 portions of the circle where each circle is divided into 3 equal parts. Right? So this was the method in which we are adding 2 by 3 4 times. Right? And what does it actually mean? See, we had a fraction 2 by 3 and when we were multiplying it by 4, we are actually multiplying this 4 only to the numerator. Right? When we have to multiply a fraction by a whole number, we are actually multiplying the whole number only to the numerator of the fraction. See here, 4 to the 8 and keep the denominator as it is. Right? So this was the multiplication of a fraction by a whole number in which only the numerator of the fraction gets multiplied by the whole number. And then we get the result. And this was the pictorial explanation for the logic. Right? 
And now, since this 8 by 3 is an improper fraction, this can be converted into mixed fraction and we will get 3 to the 6 and 2 remainder and 3 will be the denominator which will be written as it is. So, this will be the result in the form of mixed fraction. Otherwise, this is the result if you are allowed to write in improper fraction format.